brought to you by Remax Diamond Realty. All right, everybody, as the intro graphic implied, this is House to Home, where we tell you all you need to know about getting involved in the real estate market here on Guam. And once again, we have Liz and Gina from Remax Diamond Realty. Ladies, half a day and welcome back. Half a day. Okay, Thank we are you. tackling an interesting topic tonight. We're going to go really deep into this. We are talking about financing. And a lot of people I know, Liz, we'll start with you, when they talk about getting involved with the bank and then working with you as realtors and everything like that, um, it can be a lot of paperwork. There's some regulatory stuff that happens mm -hmm. to it. But just securing the loan to get a home isn't necessarily the only type of financing. There, there are other types. There, there are different types of financing, but uh, to prepare them, we always tell them, bring your last two years tax return, your last two pay stubs, employment verification, and a list of your bills. And that's actually what a loan officer will need in order to get them pre-qualified. Sometimes they do a cursory pre-qualification, but the problem is when they come to us, uh, the documents will say it's subject to um, their ability to get financing. We'd like to get that out of the way because why go through the process? Because if you got pre-qualified but the loan officer didn't know about your list of bills, it might just knock you out the door mm -hmm. and you're unable to, to get a loan. But those are things that we would require that they have so that it'll expedite the process. Excellent. And then once we have an idea of their budget, then you know we, we help them find the home. But the loan officer will help them through the different loan types that are available. And it should be noted that this isn't, you know, your what a lot of people think is like typical cheesy salesmanship for lack of a better term. These, you know, your organization and the loan officer, they're there to help you and actually get you the best possible deal, not That's just right. sell you and make a commission. That's right. Our job is to at least help them through the process so once they get to the loan officer, they've got everything ready. Right. Right. Okay. So Gina, it's interesting because um, we were talking before we began the segment about the rural development. Uh, loan and that's very very important so who qualifies for that exactly on island well if you're a first-time home buyer so you don't own any real estate there have been some instances where the person owned perhaps land that was not buildable upon you know that it wasn't easy to get the property developed so in a case like that where you already own real estate but you can't really build on it um, I've seen, you know, um, Steve Cruz at RDI, I've seen him take a look at that situation and say, you know what, we can consider funding this person to buy a first home because what they own right now is not usable for one reason or another. So the RD program is designed for the, that individual who has not bought real estate before, whose income fits into the RD program income, um, you know, qualification, and that's based on family size. You know, they look at what you're making and your family size. And before it used to be that if you wanted to utilize the RD program, you couldn't buy in debt either. Well, now that has opened mm -hmm. up. So everything is on the table right, right now. If you're interested in getting 100% financing and you're interested in using the RD program, as long as you qualify based on your income and your family size. And, and the other really important part of it too is your credit history has to be strong. They're becoming really strict about that and, and rightly so. We've had a lot of you know, in, in recent years, we've had problems with foreclosures and RD is now trying to make sure that when families purchase and use the program that they're prepared for the obligation and they know what they're getting into. So they're really in there for the long, the long term. Mm -hmm. Now to yeah. quell what some skeptics watching this may be thinking and they're like, okay, that sounds really good if I get a 100% uh, finance loan or, you know, there are terms that have been thrown around over the years like zero down and everything like that. What's the catch? And, well, and, and is there a catch? Or are these truly government services that are meant to provide even, good even, deals? For even though they say it's a 100% um, RD loan, it doesn't mean nothing out of pocket. Right. You still have to come out with monies out of pocket to cover your closing costs. Now, um, with the RD loan, the banks will allow for them, for example, they, they wanted additional monies to cover their closing costs. They will allow for that in the loan provided mm -hmm. the appraisal is over, so for example, if you bought a house for 120000 and you needed 10000 they could raise your loan to 130 provided the house appraises to 130 or 140 It has to appraise above the actual value of the property in order to include your closing costs. So although it's people think, well, it's free, it's not. It's, it's a loan, yes, it's 100% guaranteed. However, you do need closing costs. There are other programs out there that will cover uh, closing costs and will assist you like the government um, grant that they're giving uh, that would help in in um, in your closing costs mm -hmm. now Gina um, a question about closing costs right now because um, if I'm a first-time homeowner and I'm you know obviously getting a 
place for the very first time. What am I looking at in, as, a, as a ballpark figure in terms of yeah. knowing what I have to pay for closing costs? And then conversely to that, if I'm someone who has owned many, many homes over the years and everything, and I get you know loan after loan, I pay it down, does the closing cost begin to decrease as time goes on because I'm a repeat customer? Or? No, okay. no, that's not how they look at it. No bulk discount? No bulk <laughs> discount. In, in fact, you know, um, and this is, uh, we, we, we can talk about this type of buyer on another segment because it's a whole different ball game, mm -hmm. but actually the more repeat you are as a buyer, the, le the less it becomes easy to get these bank loans. Like for instance, mm -hmm. right now as a consumer, if I have four more, more than four mortgages, I basically will not be able to avail myself of the Freddie Mac back loans, which is what the banks are particular to mm -hmm. because they have a guarantee. But going back to these RD buyers, there's really no catch. RD was a, a program that was designed to help people get into the, you know, the American dream, owning your own home, you, you know, being able to, to buy a house. So it, and the closing cost, we calculate the closing cost is anywhere from six to seven percent of the amount you're going to borrow. But as Liz mentioned earlier, part of that closing cost can get booked into the loan. Oh. So you really can put yourself into a house with as little as two to three thousand mm -hmm. dollars. And more recently, we've come across a different program where it the banks will give you a loan to pick up before you could not finance a home that needed work or was of needed repairs. Mm -hmm. It's not financeable. But actually, the banks are becoming creative. They, if you qualify and if you're a good customer, they will give you a bridge loan. They'll give you money to buy the house and they call it a construction loan. Then they take that and sell it to RD so they could get all their money back. All right. Well, obviously, Great this is programs. a very, very technical <laughs> technical topic, um, and we will include some links on our website. If you go to the YouTube channel, we'll, we'll put a lot of links for those of you out there looking to get a home loan. Or they can call us. All right, exactly. Well, thank you very much, ladies. Thank you. Thank all you. right, stay tuned because we will be back right after this.